what do you seek to achieve by this collaboration? Yeah, uh, this is uh, a ready resource. I mean, you have over 2,000 school children here uh, between the ages of 5 and 16. Uh, that's a prime age to develop in any sport. Uh, people, say, people say we don't have uh, facilities in Nigeria, but this is a, a school which has four tennis courts, two basketball courts, and we have opportunity to do cross training. You have a track there, you have a football field, you have a swimming pool right there. So it, 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 it provides all the elements to produce world-class players. So if we have this and we have the opportunity to have boarding, uh, a boarding function to, to the entire process. So during the holidays, we can invite uh, players of junior players from all over the country uh, to to give them the right fundamentals, high performance training. You see, we've got all the equipment. We have balls. We have ball machines. We have, I mean, every equipment that we need to produce world class players. We have, and and because of the fact that we are able to provide high performance training, uh, these children will go from, as you find, almost zero in six months to tournament to become tournament players. All right, uh, um, quickly, um, we know you have an eye for talent, and I'm sure you believe what the next Mary Law. From what you've seen here today, how what, have you been excited with the kind of talent that are here on display? Yeah, it, 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 yes, we are we are very excited, not just with those here now, with those who have registered for the program, but we you know we've we've run uh, mass training programs here that has attracted that had attracted over six hundred students at, at a time with our American partners. So we have a lot of talent here. But like like we're saying, we're not limiting it only to this school. We're going to attract uh, students from other places weekend programs, holiday programs with residential uh, uh, provisions and all that, so that this becomes a true, this is the first uh, proper t tennis academy with a residential uh, function to it in Nigeria, and it, it's resident in a school. So I think Green Spring is, uh, is, is setting the pace, it's, it's, uh, is, is, is leading in this, in this direction, and, and I think it's it's, it's, the, it's worth it because, I mean, for a school to have these kind of facilities, it behoves on every stakeholder to make sure that the facilities are maximally used. How do you think this can actually assist in life? Well, in reality, academics cannot succeed without sports. And so, at Green Spring School, our curriculum, the whole thing, is to ensure that we succeed academically. And since we know that you need sports to succeed academically, we're looking at different areas of sports to empower our children. Because really, it's not just about winning championships, which is great. It's great for them to become professionals, but it is also great for them at an early age to learn to have a lifestyle of exercising, of recreation, and all of that. And so that's why we do all of this. It's becoming very, very important for sports to, I mean, um, to be an integral part, not just an add-on. It needs to be an integral part of education. And that's what we're trying to do. How often do you want to be doing this? How often? It's, it's going to be a lifestyle for them. And so, I, I mean, they'll come out here three times a week for practice because, of course, they're involved in other sports, remember? They're involved in other sports. And so that is key for us. So we'll be doing this every, I mean, um, three times a week professionally. But you know, if, you, if the um, interest is developed, then they will come out on their own when the pots are free to continue engaging. Someone said, you know, it's fun, it's entertaining, and so they'll do it. It is exercise, it exercises every part of the body, so they'll do it. And it rejuvenates, you know, the brain. So thinking is sharper, I mean, they're able to focus on the education, they are disciplined, because really you can't play sports successfully without being disciplined. So all of that will happen. What would you be hoping to see probably some one of your pupils probably get discovered and take it to the next level? Absolutely, absolutely. And we even know that there are a whole lot of um, rough 
<laughs> diamonds and diamonds in the making here and we believe that you know through these exercises through this engagement the international tennis academy they will be found out and they will be sharpened and you know polished to become you know the star of the future i mean they've said it themselves and the children they will get there once they have that aspiration what's your assessment of this how do you feel sorry sir uh, yeah uh, yeah so this is a very important day uh you know green spring school is committed to excellence it's excellence in the classroom and also outside of the classroom. You know, we know that sports and academics go together. So in order to have a world-class school, uh, to, to offer world-class things, things like the ITA needs to come in as a partner, which we've engaged them so that the students can learn technique. It's one thing to love tennis, to want to play tennis. It's another thing to learn proper technique and to be able to have a chance at even making this a career. And so we know that sports uh, makes us better professionals ultimately, makes us better family members. And so we're so happy on this occasion to, to offer this. And it's, uh, it's good not only for Green Springs, it's good for Lagos and all of Nigeria. What have you been able to get or learn from this? So lately I've been, learn I've been learning about the 400 Nibakan and different ways to serve the tennis ball. And I've also learned the postures in tennis. So, your uh, aspiration, why, why, why are you coming to tennis? You have so, soccer, you have others? I actually play a lot of them. And I love tennis because like, they improve my thinking skills. And I also want to play tennis because I want to one day go to a world to play. So where's, your, where's your favorite tennis star? Where's your idol in tennis? So, my idol in tennis is Serena Williams. And also, I like Djokovic, Nadal, and Sumina.